This procedure video will take you through the techniques for performing a lumbar puncture. As with most potential procedures, you may be asked to perform either part of the procedure or most of the procedure in the OSCE station. It may be that you're asked to explain the procedure to a medical student and explain the indications for performing a lumbar puncture in the emergency department. Again, the formal introduction and explanation of the procedure and obtaining of verbal consent is essential. This is of course a sterile procedure and as such universal precautions are mandatory. Hand washing, the donning of sterile gloves and gowns must be undertaken and suggested to the examiner. Now we're going to talk through how to do a lumbar puncture. Explain to the patient why this needs to be done and exactly what you're going to do. Make sure the patient is comfortable and understands this is very, very important. You lie them on their left lateral side with their back very close to the edge of the bed. Their knees bent up and their tin chin tucked in. It's often a good idea to also have a pillow underneath their head and sometimes also to put a pillow between their legs will also help. So while they're in that position, warn them they'll be there for a good 5-10 minutes and then start preparing your equipment. And now I'll put on sterile gloves. and begin to prepare the patient. So with your gauze, start centrally in the area and start moving outwards 